Hello guys, we are back for another video. Make sure you hit that notification bell so you are notified when we do upload. And also let me know what you guys um, think in the comments. And also if you like the content, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Um, we are going to be talking about um, Martel Hope and Melody Cherie Rogers. For those of you that know um, and who follows the show and or you follow them on social media, you know that there was information that was released um, by a third party that allegedly Martel and Arianne Curry was attempting to put out a porn tape um, and use it against Melody as some sort of leverage. Um, now, we have not heard much about that. And as we know, um, it is a process, you know, for things to be investigated. Um, it's just a process. It does not happen that quickly. Um, what we have saw in the past, we have saw... Um, well, let's just go back to the reunion. It was alleged at the reunion by Martel that there was a video out of Melody in an intimate position with another man other than him, which we already know. We know that happened several years ago, um, and it looks like the seed was just being planted to come back and basically say, hey, you know, we said that before. And now being that Carson knew Arianne, Carson was able to say, hey, you know, she said, you know, mentioned to me that that is exactly what he was using her for um, to actually put the information out online um, to basically tarnish Melody's reputation. Um, and Carson came out and basically stated that she knew it to be a lie because Ariane confessed this information to her. Um, so we know that Melody and her team um, definitely was working to um, get this back into court and under some type of legal jurisdiction and i should have shouldn't have said get it back into court because this situation was never in court um but it is a new situation and potentially a criminal matter um now there is some situ some i can't talk there is some situation there is information out that's stating that melody and martel are back in court um, so we're wondering exactly what they are in court for. Um, as we do know, they did have a custody um, case, but from my perspective and all the information that I have, that particular case has been closed unless, you know, something else has happened and it has been reopened. But for right now, we know that there is a case that is moving forward and we are just wondering, is this that porn um, case that um, we have saw and heard about on social media? Again, you know, with regards to the legal, the legal system, um, things just does not move that quickly. So we're wondering, is this particular court case um, regarding this potential um porn revenge porn situation as we do know um melody um has started to follow a popular um attorney who does take a lot of cases with regards to revenge p cases um so i've been watching on social media i don't think i saw anything with regards to give me any type of indication as far as what is really going on um, with this particular case that is now um, coming up in court. We do see the previews of Love and Marriage Huntsville, which I do have posted on my social media um, site. So please go ahead and check that out. But in those clips, I really see Martel playing nice as if he's trying to woo Melody to take him back. And we all know that that is not going to happen. Um, we do know that, you know, those 
particular episodes are filmed several months in advance, but this definitely could be Martel just trying to play nice so he don't take his A to jail. Um, because by his own admittance, he did somewhat admit that he had um, played a part in this revenge um, P case. And being that Carson also had posted on her social media months earlier that she is actually potentially getting a lawyer um, to sue both Ariane Curry and Martel Hope for slander. Um, because as she's stating that they are basically trying to deny everything and she is stating that she wholeheartedly had a conversation with Arion and that the information that she has disclosed is in fact true. So I'm trying to find out from you guys, what do you think? Um, do you think this new case that is in the court is dealing directly with this situation with regards to the revenge porn case. Um, I know some time has, um, you know, moved on. Um, I know originally Melody seemed that she was really persistent on getting this matter resolved. I don't know, maybe, you know, Martel, you know, is being nice. Maybe it's something she's not looking to move forward with, but we do know that there is a case that is going on now and just trying to find out, does that have anything to do with this revenge P, um, you know, allegations that has been floating around on the internet um, for some time? Let me know what you guys think. Um, basically, we're just trying to gather the information and put the pieces together. Um, hopefully you guys have watched that trailer um, of Love and Marriage Huntsville. And watching that trailer, Martel um, is definitely acting like a weirdo. We see him again, seems like he wants to be so much in love with Melody again. This guy is like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. It's like one way, one I'm sorry, one minute he's this way, the next minute he's another way. Again, he could, you know, just be putting on as we have saw him do this so many times in the past to get Melody to basically be in his good graces so he can turn around and do some more BS because we know that is exactly who Martel Holt is. He is a dark Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde personality, um, and he's quite the manipulator. So y'all let me know what y'all think in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe um, to my channel. We will be talking about all things Love and Marriage Huntsville. Um, we still have a few more weeks, and we will be going through those um, episodes just like I do my other reality shows. Again, I will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to let me know what you guys think in the comments as you always do.